All right, so this is something that you should never do with your pool pump motor. And if you haven't already, please consider subscribing and giving this video a like. Now, what we're gonna do is talk about pool motor conduits. A conduit is a tube that the electrical wires are housed in. Conduits protect wires as well as anyone who might be close to the wires. Now, a normal pump motor will have a conduit, just like this one. Most do. But with this customer, well, she took it a step further, or maybe backwards. The timer box has seen better days. In fact, it's not even being used. And the conduit is laying on the ground right here. So you might be asking, how is the motor being turned on and off? Well, that's a great question. So we come down here and we can see the motor is not bonded. Here's the bond wire. It should go right there. We follow the conduit from the box and it goes, well, nowhere. It should be installed in the motor, but it's not. We can see a wire out of the motor right here and we follow it up and it goes into, check that out, a Christmas light timer. How cool is that? So turn your volume down just a little bit because I'm gonna pull the plug and the motor is gonna turn off. That's what she was doing. She overrode the pool timer and conduit and simply used a Christmas light timer to turn the pump motor on and off. She said she saw it on YouTube. Folks, please don't do this. Set it up correctly. Wiring needs to be in a conduit and the motor needs to be bonded. Now, if yours is not, it's best to call in a certified pool contractor or licensed electrician to do it the right way.